Travis is in this position that he, he can't really go to a typical gym. I said, wow, all of these people, veterans, civilian, there's people with physical disabilities. They've sort of been Love those folks right there, and apparently Starbucks does too. They're doing more than brewing coffee and making lattes these days. Venturing into inspiration now with a digital series called Upstanders, and the first one includes some familiar faces to us. We featured former NFL player David Vabora in our documentary, A New Kind of Courage, just a couple of months ago. He started a gym basically that helps amputees to do some amazing things, and it's all happening right here in North Texas. Uh, we also featured Brian. Ryan Aft, who lost his legs while serving our country, and he's in that Starbucks series as well. Yeah, their stories are nothing short of inspiring. So Starbucks says it wants to identify and inspire great citizens across the country. CEO Howard Schultz hopes the series will help the company connect directly with customers. Now, the company says it will promote the series in stores and on its mobile app over the next 10 weeks. Again, this is called Upstanders. It's by Starbucks. They couldn't have picked a better group of people to start off with there. And the interesting Interesting thing with Starbucks, they said that the reason that they did this is because they noticed that we as a society are getting just too cynical. They yeah. wanted to put some positive stories out there, see if they can kind of change the vibe a little bit. And these are two folks in a 10 part series, which is amazing. Really, you know, pushing the envelope strength from coffee now to inspiring people, which is pretty awesome. Great to see them getting that national recognition, though.